Hello everyone, thank you for watching this very special myth-busting episode brought to you by the forum members of LyingMan.com as a service to Singapore's kite community. The first question we're going to tackle concerns kite string. Does it sing when under tremendous tension or is it just a myth? Helping us today is Mr. Lyang Man himself who is going to briefly explain what we're going to do. This one actually uh, prevent this guy from overflying. This is good. Do foils overfly? This guy, uh, our wind here sucks and uh, you overfly. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do, who's the first sucker of the first line? <laughs> vector, Vector, you're holding my line. Okay, I'm going to sucker. You're a sucker now. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, the hook is how many pounds? It doesn't this, matter. This line will go. This is 140. The, the hook is 140. The, the line okay. is uh, is 50. So, you're going to have to go together. Okay, at the end, we're going to launch it. Uh. You release as much line as you can. Uh. That is like Try to keep up. Uh. Try to keep up. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody who wants to listen to the thing we sing, uh, stay with Vector. This one, this one is Vector. <laughs> Paul, Paul. You don't need an anchor. You were uh, young enough for this or not? <laughs> Real in or real out here? This is 50 pound line trying to pull a how many pound kite? <laughs> 8 square meters, okay? okay I have... oh, 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 your Okay, just lock it in place and hold it. Just lock it in place and hold it. Then walk a bit closer. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. Do we hear any sound? No, nothing yet. Got it. Okay. It's starting to sing. Okay. 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 Oh my God. Seriously, a fifty-pound line holding this. Uh. See, Pat Patrick's. Okay. Come here. Come here. Anyone here? Kite singing. You hear that? Yeah. That's creepy. That's a fool. That is creepy. You think like that because your oil is off. Your this piece is gonna break. Oh. Hey, maybe it's rated for fifty pounds, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All you need is one gas, you go. No, but it also proves your your theory when you were talking to Aram, huh? and you were saying that um, kite lines don't just snap like that. Huh? Yes. See, look, the main the main safety line is totally slack. Not all of the all of the strength is being taken on the on, on this 50 pound line. If you feel the sudden gas coming at any time soon, you will go. Yeah. And you can hear it. Okay, yeah, hear that? It's creepy. Whoa, it's creepy. Okay. I can see signs of giving already, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Here, yeah. the lines are giving. Yeah. You see? Do you see the fibers? Fibers are popping. Here you can see the contrast. Okay. I can hear it screaming. Right? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. White fibers? White fibers are yeah, coming. coming out. You see that? Okay. It's coming out. Why is this the stress point? Because this is where you hold it. Here also, inside also. You see or not? Okay, okay, it's gonna snap. It's gonna snap very soon. Okay, watch your, cover your eyes. Too close, huh? Oh, it's screaming, it's screaming. <laughs> oh, no. oh. I didn't get it on film! <laughs> I switched off my camera! <laughs> and then a quick recovery on that line! <laughs> Do 
Okay, okay let's have a look at it. Look at, check out how it snapped. But it's stuck here. That's strange. Yeah. Sure. Okay, this is the snap point. And this is how it gave way. There was no friction, it was just pure, pure pulling on this by a monster kite up there. Okay, eating away this. So what happened is that when the when the line snapped, I can't even my perspective, my depth perception is, is gone. See that? Wow, it twisted all the way around. Wow, oh, respect, man. This is twisted nylon, just three strands, and it held up against that monster for quite a long time. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Honor of doing it. <laughs> okay. Just very fast. Ah, just okay. all the way there. So this is rated at how many how many pounds did it tell you? Yeah, half a million. Huh? Eighty pounds, huh? Eighty pounds, huh? Can go slightly beyond. Okay, what we're doing is that we're taking um, eighty pound in inverted comma uh, because there's no real way to tell test line from uh, this is basically radial tire wire, and we're going to connect it to a monster like this. Okay, which is an eight square meter lifter from Peter Lin. All right, the wind's roaring away. Okay, and I will go back. Lock your line, lock your line. Can you feel it? How's the pull of the kite? Is your uh, is your line making any noise yet? <laughs> no wonder. Give your light. Okay, all the weight of the kite is being taken on this 80 pound radial tire wire line, and it's a bit of an effort to lock it in. You gotta lock it in. <laughs> okay, all right. Is the line showing any signs of stress? You'll hear some singing before uh, before the line snaps. Okay, we've had a lull in the wind, but the wind's picking up now. No, it's singing, it's singing. Yeah. Oh, oh, snap! Snap, snap! Got it on a safety line. So excited. <laughs> snap! Can we have a look at the line? At which point did it break? <laughs> come, let's get an opinion from the expert what happened just now. How come there was very little singing and suddenly the line snapped? Simple. <laughs> singing of the line to warn you before the line snaps. Right. Okay. Right. okay. Here are some lessons to take away. Number one, always use the right poundage of line for your kite. You can get away with 50 pound line on a kite that demands 500 pounds of line for only a very short while. Wind conditions change very quickly and you often have no warning at all. Number two, if your kite is in the air and the wind suddenly picks up, don't panic and don't fight the kite. The worst thing to do is reel in your line when it's already much too taut. You're just forcing the line to break. Number three, 
Some tension is okay, but if it builds up slowly enough, you will hear your kite line start to make noises. Once it's singing, your line has less than 25% left of strength left to bear. One unexpected gust and it will snap unexpectedly. Last but not least, your line may not break where you expect it to. We saw signs of stress develop near the reel and the anchor, but in both cases, the line snapped very close to the kite. We hope you found this presentation useful, and if there's any more myths you'd like us to investigate, you're welcome to contact us through the forum at www.layoungman.com. Take care.